pharmaceutical industry of Bangladesh is uh, one of our uh, success stories. pharmaceutical uh, industry has grown from strength to strength and today uh, is meeting 98% of the local demand and is also exporting to over 100 uh, countries in the world. So uh, we are uh, actually very, uh, very happy to note that Sun Pharma has decided to uh, invest in this new plant in Bangladesh. For a variety of reasons, for a number of reasons. Uh, first, as you know, uh, we are approaching 2026 when we will be graduating and the advantages which Bangladesh received as an LDC is uh, going to uh, change. Similarly, the TRIPS uh, agreement is also going to be changing. So both Indian pharma sector and the Bangladesh pharma sector will be facing similar challenges. So I think uh, this is the time, although in these last uh, decades, the Bangladesh and the, uh, Bangladesh and the Indian uh, pharmaceutical industry have developed uh, independently to some extent, I think now cooperation between the two industries is more and more necessary. So that's one reason, keeping trips in mind. The second is that uh, the pharmaceutical sector as a whole is uh, changing. Uh, there are new uh, products which are coming up and especially with the new technology, with artificial intelligence, there is going to be a massive uh, transformation of the pharmaceutical industry as we know it. We are already seeing biosimilars becoming very, very uh, important. Uh, I am told that of the top 10 pharmaceutical products which are sold in the world today, eight are biosimilars. So these are again areas where both India and Bangladesh have not yet been able to take a big share of the world market. So there is another area, the technological change which is taking place uh, because of technology, new technology. So there is again, I think, a huge amount of uh, uh, areas of cooperation between the two industrial sectors symbolizes many dimensions of the transformation that is shaping India-Bangladesh relations. At one level, it is about our growing economic and industrial engagement. At another level, it is about our optimism in each other's future. It is about how Indian businesses are now looking to Bangladesh as an investment destination. And at yet another level, Today's event is about growing partnership in areas which have a huge bearing on our future prosperity. In this case, our cooperation in health security. As India and Bangladesh continue to take strides to fulfill their destiny, with Bangladesh aspiring to become a developed country driven by knowledge economy by 2041, and with India, focused on joining the ranks of world's developed economies by 2047. There are new opportunities emerging for our cooperation, built upon our new capabilities, as well as our new aspirations. Today's event is a snapshot of those convergences.